The more fish farming has been embraced, the more fish feeds have become scarce in Uganda. This underscores the need for more production in fish feeds, a reason why investors need to exploit this opportunity. If there is any investor who really wants to invest now in Uganda, should be able to invest in fish feed, which is the current need for Uganda. Whereas fish farming is the way to go in the country, almost 80% of the investment goes to fish feeds. In most cases, the feeds are imported, which not only remains expensive, but also keeps the venture on its knees. So at the end of the day, we end up going again outside to, to import. And the more you import, the more you incur a lot of costs. It could, however, be a thing of the past if efforts by National Agricultural Research Organization are anything to go by. Seen applying his expertise is Ondoro Constantin Chobet, an agriculture research officer from the Regional Fish Fry Center in Imbali. He is leading research to ensure these black soldier flies give the best fish feeds to fish farmers. After hashing, we introduce them the, the, the hashed larvae to, into a, a, a mixture of organic material. This organic material are simple raw materials that come from agro processes. It is a process that starts from laying eggs all the way to final production of fish feeds. You need a maximum of only one kilogram to produce one kilogram of fish. In terms of money, it means you are spending 3,000 shillings worth of feed to produce uh, 20,000 shillings worth of, of fish. It is a project for which government earmarked 1 billion Uganda shillings to be released in phases of three financial years. About 150 million has so far been released. Now, that money we have used for, for developing the technology for producing black soldier fly and also the technology for, for, for making the food, the organic material for producing the black soldier fly larvae. The next phase will be for popularization and mindset change, something that the line minister has welcomed. And soon, when our scientists come together and we have uh, available resources, we can be able to handle it through narrow and uh, research and also uh, generally a fisheries institute in Kajansi. Fish farmers have relied on imported feeds, while others have processed silverfish and undertaken said to be expensive. It is a challenge that the introduction of the black soldier fly is seeking to address. Henry Okrut, UBC.